Hey guys, it's me, Adrian Lag, and today I have another video, and as you know, probably, I am going to be doing daily up uploads for uh, winter break, so, you know, because of no school and stuff. So yeah, um, today I'm going to be, uh, you know, basically showing you how the TNT can that I showcased yesterday works, so... Um, let's go to my experimental, you know, general, and we're going to have to fly back here. Uh, hold on. This might take a while, but luckily, I, I spawned myself right next to a gigantic desert biome. And as you can see, there is my cannon right here. So, um... Oh, no, it's not loaded. Okay, so, first, let's... Mm, I'll be back when I load it. And actually, I'm just going to do it right here. So, um... As you might be able to see, um, this is actually based off of Michael Mitchell M's design, and quite ingenious, but however, his design did not work for 1.0. Um, it actually blew up right in my face, so, um, yeah, <laughs> a little shout out to him, uh, you know, but still, um, I made some modifications to it, and it works out quite, quite nicely, if I must, if I must say for myself. So, um, basically what happens here is that, once I press this button, um, uh, it, it sends three signals, one, um, here, uh, one down here and one to that side. So let's start with this side because it is by far the most interesting one. So um, as we can see, we have a button here and we have three repeaters. Three repeaters aren't necessary, but if you want to make it with only one button, I would highly recommend three repeaters. Um, all set on uh, fullest delay. And that is just so that um, the firing mechanism, which is this side, doesn't activate at the same time that the reloading mechanism, which is this side, um, happens. So, this is just to delay the firing from the reloading, otherwise everything will just blow up. So, and it's a perfect delay, it happens right after the reloading starts. So what we have is three repeaters, full delay, and onto a, um, inverter, which reverses the signal onto a zero delay, repeater and here I have an array of uh, repeaters onto redstone torches which are turned off and once I press the button and send a signal here it will turn these off thereby turning these on uh, which activate the TNT so um and put oh wait, what was that and because of the TNT drop uh, being activated um activated TNT is uh, affected by gravity so it will fall down into uh, let me see if I can get a good angle. It fell on, fall down to the water pit, and from there it's just elementary uh, TNT cannon for you. So I'm not gonna go through that. I have limited time here. Uh, family stuff, and you know what. So um, after I have these done, uh, the signal travels here. Three delay uh, goes here, 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 and here. Same design, but this is just so that the, the a piece of TNT being fired doesn't blow up at the same time that the firing the shot is. So if that happens, and it's just gonna blow up right in your face um, because there's no water to bunker the to buffer the explosion. So basically, this just makes gives a little delay on this TNT being activated, so that it can actually fly and then explode, as we saw there earlier. So <coughs> sorry. Now let's get into more interesting parts here. So, once I press this button, wait, what? What? Uh, this, I think I made a mistake here. <laughs> I have no idea what happened. Wait, what? <laughs> Shouldn't this be connected here? Uh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> something, sorry, something weird happened there, um, 
I have no idea. I just realized I made a mistake, but nonetheless, it seems to work out well, so I will do it. So, um, basically, let's follow this path. So, this activates first, and this is a reload mechanism, as, and this is supposed to be filled with TNT, and once the TNT, um, so, and this is supposed to be stacked with sand all the way to the top. So, um, first, this activates here, and this, uh, let's go here. So, this current travels to, towards this repeater, goes along the back here, and another inverting thing. So, once these fire, this will become burnt out, and the snow will crack, and then the sand will fall down, and uh, because it's a button, once the charge comes back, the piston will re-extend, um, and it will push sort of what we call a blank round um, onto the into the basically the chain of TNT. So at the same time, this uh, sends a signal here again, it inverts it, and basically what that does is it will push this back. It will pull this back so that this cup that. So that, that this, uh, let's replace this with TNT for a second. Oh. Uh, I did not mean to do that. So, um, dang it. Hold on, hold up. There we are. And do this. Boom. 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 Oh, okay, um, and so, basically, what will happen is that, uh, so that the, so basically, um, it's going to retract, and, once the spacer, space around it gets pushed in here, and the piston, piston re-extends, it will push this, um, this TNT, out in here, and that's where the interesting stuff happens. So, this pulls back, um, yeah, so, this pulls, oh, hold on, I'm just trying to find the words, this pulls back, this gets sent out into here, and this pushes it down. Uh, yeah, and... Wait, sorry. Some sounds. And once that happens, by the time that all of this has happened, the TNT is down here. Well, it's supposed to be like that. Um, then, when this... Sorry. When this gets fired, um, the current reaches here, it inverts, um, inverting the torches, and then these torches power, power these blocks, which then push the TNT down, uh, this, these blocks power these, this array, and this array powers the redstone repeaters, and the repeaters, um, extend the pistons, this gets pushed here, which is adjacent to the power sources, and becomes activated, being susceptible to gravity, and because of the late signal, this will get activated a little shorter. Um, so, let's see if we can replay this by putting some sand here. So, we'll just do one round, and... Uh, yeah, it doesn't have to be exact, but... So, yeah, um, let's push it. And so basically, it gets sent, position pushes it there, space around it, it activates. You saw the delay, and that gets shot. Ooh, I think that was the farthest yet. Yes, that was actually mighty far. I have no idea how that happened, but worked out quite well. So, as you can see, this is my TNT cannon, but again, uh, Michael Mitchell M's design it had some weird thing going like here, and this is different, this was much different, and I surrounded with glass. And it had two buttons, actually, one for reloading, one for firing. I just made that into one thing, and I just added the repeaters. So that made it a little easier to handle, and I 
Um, actually, you can extend the range of this. Um, <coughs> let's try to extend the range. Um, so, do this. That here. Get some redstone. And once you figure it, the conceptual design about it, it actually isn't that challenging, so... Yeah, wait, hold on. Yeah, hello guys, and it's me, um, Nature Lag. And today... Well, well, not today, but... Yeah, yeah, um, I was sort of interrupted in my recording of the TNT tutorial, and I fixed it, made it much longer, and it fired, uh, 23 blocks more, which is quite an improvement for just, uh, one thing, so, today I'm going to, well, right now I'm going to MC edit, um, my cannon, and hopefully we can get some decent range out of it. Um, I know I'm adding this right after. I'm like I'm doing this the day after I recorded like the previous part, the one with me showing how to do this. But um, yeah. Wait. <sighs> okay. So let's open this. And let's go to redstone experiments. And what? I'm still a little newbie at this. I just I basically downloaded this a week ago, you might say. Um, and something's messed up. Well, dang it. Okay, let's try to delete. All the evidence of life forms now. So, um, let's just okay, take this, delete, and now we can nudge. Okay, um, deselect. Now I can import my schematic and. Yeah, it's this. And. Uh, let's keep it right over here. Yeah, import. Okay, now, um, here is when the somewhat challenging part begins. But do not fear. So basically what we do is I move this I move this part, take it, and I delete it. Delete. Now next basically I deselect uh, I want to select this whole region that can be repeated, uh, the standard, basically, re region, and double check, check our selections, and uh, it didn't go through here, let's do that, and nudge, nudge the selection, down one, wait, no, wait, what? Whoa, what was up with that? Wait, hold on. What? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I told you I'm still a little noob at this. So don't get me wrong, I love I love doing this, but really like it's a little confusing because, you know, the UI isn't the greatest and the steering wheel isn't like the easiest, so but 
Uh, shall we... let's clone this and repeat it, let's say... wait. First we need to line this up. Is that lined up? Ah, oh, no. Okay, nudge. Okay, and let's repeat it, let's say, three times. No, let's make, no, <laughs> not 34. Let's try four. No, wait. Yeah, three sounds good. Do that, clone. And looks like we have a decent thing here, and let's save this without tampering around with that much, and go, and go ahead, delete, I mean exit, exit out of it, open Minecraft, and make this easy for you, and go in here, and yes! Uh, okay. Before all this stuff updates, I need to quickly do this. This seems to be resolved. Oh. Purposes. Let's fill this in. Not to do that. And so now we are going to add the the no 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 no. Dang it. Hmm. I'm frustrated right now. Wow. I'm just really frustrated. Well, if you could see my face then, you'd, you'd be like... So mad. It's not even funny. Okay, let's do this. Patch up this issue. For... I hate moving so slow in water. I really do. Okay, wait. Um, let's see. Everything seems in order now. Let's just do this. No. No, the mouse is bad as shit. And uh, let's do a little thing here. So I can maneuver the current around. Uh, this seems self explanatory. I'm here, I'm here. Might want to do this. Okay, this here, do this. Okay, one, full tick. Full tick. So you are that again. Oops. One, two, three. Uh, four. One, two. How are we going to do this? We're going to do this. One, two, three, four, five. Yes. Must be five delay for optimal. Testing purposes. So, we shall do this. This here. Up here. Do this. And. Uh, 
get that here, Peter here. Sand. It's really frustrating to work in a place with tons of sand, especially when you're doing like uh, underground work to mask it. It is just obnoxious because when you're trying to what? When you're trying to carve something out, it just becomes really annoying. Okay. Hmm. Check to see if everything's in order. Oh, forgot to load the sand here. I'm not gonna like beautify it right now. I'm just gonna get the test done with um so everyone can go home. This daily upload thing is ridiculous somehow. I should I should have never agree to that. Really, it's just ridiculous. How much work you have to put in. Ugh. Okay. It's not bad. Do this and I know this has to be keep in mind that this block here right next to the launching thing has to like absolutely has to be a redstone wire cannot be a repeater otherwise the whole thing will blow up and I have to learn that the hard way uh hopefully you people don't I told you um yeah it's just obnoxious this took me like about a week or so to perfect uh, nonetheless it was definitely worth it so Looks like we have everything in order, apart from the water. We definitely do want the water here. So let's keep the... Uh, oh. Boom. 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 It worked out perfectly. So let's take... Yes, actually, I think I'm going to do brick slab, just because I think it looks better. So nice brick slab, and what is going on over here? Nope, nothing. It's just nothing. Okay, um, final check. Uh, this might not be enough, just in case, I'm just going to add the repeater here. The signal can carry the uh, same as here, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Mm, that's close. That is very, very close. That's like obscenely close. But, so now, um, my, the, the schematics that I posted, uh, like, in the previous video, it had, it shot 61 blocks, I counted the, the F3 menu here, um, then the plus one added 23 blocks to that, and, you might be able to see, but it blew this little hole over here. I'm sure it packed, I patched it up, but it did blow that far, and here too. Uh, this is, of course, the main 61 blocks, so my, ex my expectations is that it will probably go around here, if not farther. Um, yeah, so, uh, let's get this underway. Final system check. Okay, three, 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 three. Yep, should work. Should work. Okay, and... 
team. Yes, it's working. Whoa! <laughs> oh my god, did you guys see that? That was obscene. That was completely, utterly obscene. Um, but however, I did think that the, that it detonated a little short. So let's add a little more. Oh, that scared me so much. Okay. Let's add a little more delay here. Let's try it again. And. Okay, let me just take an F3 up here where it's being shot. So, F3 is that. Wait. It is at 83. 83 blocks and let's count from there. 83 blocks, 2, infinity, and beyond. Oh, this is just epic. Oh my god, I'm like, I'm feeling so proud right now. Yes, this is a blast hole. And farthest farthest reaches is to one ninety four. So um one ninety four to eighty three. That is a hundred and eleven. A hundred and eleven blocks. Wow. Oh my god. This baby shoots 111 and it's automatic. 111 bucks. So, just an attempt to grief the land royally. Let's go shoot. Shoot it. And... I'm fun with this. Wow, I'm really proud of it. it. Took a long time, but it did work out. I'm so happy. Like, if you could see me right now, I'm sprinting. Um, it is possible to add add more rounds. Shall we check on here? So from 83 to... Ooh, I think it extended a little bit. So from 83 to blocks... 202. So this is the new blast. Uh... Limit basically. Uh, let, me, let me try to scan this random. Nope. Um. Yep. So. I actually do. No. Yeah. So. Two. Two or three actually. Two or three to. Blocks. Block number. Block number 83, so 202, 203 to 83, do the math, really, it's just obscene, 202 to block, 202 to block 83, just like speeches, 140 blocks, wait, let me just, Uh, 202 to 83, I, I do believe that is about, like, 140 blocks. So, this guy can shoot 140 blocks. I am thoroughly impressed. So, yeah, um, I will be posting a link to this schematic in the description, and, yeah, I'm just really proud of that. I wonder what would happen if you... It seems to increase exponential, exponentially, uh, as, you know, so that means that TNT blasts, uh, have a exponential quadratic, um, launching function, which means that 
the more, yeah, it increases exponentially um, the more TNT you have to launch. So I wonder what will happen if we copy that just a little more times. Uh, yeah, I'm going to aim for here. Let's just call this. No, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to do sandstone. Let's just call this Victory Monument. <laughs> and once we get here... Oh my god, look how far away that is. That is just crazy. So let's aim for here. And I will be... See you tomorrow. And tomorrow I will already doing this and I sh hopefully John uh, Laro Bly if you're watching this please come on Skype because I um I used certain measures to get uh, uh Machi back so yeah um I will see you guys guys and John if you're watching this let's just like just come on because you know, I'm ready, and yeah, I'll see you guys later, peace.